challenge day one. <laughs> On today's menu, we have a green smoothie, roasted vegetables and hard boiled eggs, a boiled grapefruit, cauliflower rice with slow cooker chicken, and dark chocolate. I have a strange feeling I'm gonna be cooking all day today. So let's get started. I can't figure out how to put the blender together. <laughs> yeah. You just put it on top and push down really hard? You don't, it's not, what? You don't turn it. No, the glass part has the sharp spinny thing, but I'm putting that part onto the p part with the buttons. Because when I just put it there, it wobbles a lot. Time to try my first BuzzFeed cleaning challenge recipe, the banana coconut green smoothie. Wish me luck. It's not actually bad. <coughs> A little weird, but I could drink this. So I'm gonna rate the taste a B and the preparation an A minus just because my blender was being dumb and pouring things out of the bottom. So I got my fennel and I got my red onions and I'm supposed to chop these up and cook them. I don't really know how to deal with this giant plant, so I'm gonna have to look up on YouTube how to cut fennel. And pull off the stained outer uh, leaves of the fruit. Aha! I got me some fennel. My eyes are watering. I'm gonna cry. I always thought those onion goggles looked really dumb and that only an idiot would buy them. I really want some onion goggles. My nose is running because I'm crying. Oh my god. I didn't think there would be tears on the first day. Oh, ah, probably shouldn't touch my eyes. Oh. Okay, okay. Almost done. Almost done. Done cutting onions. I'm gonna go clean up myself because I was crying so much my makeup started to run. This is how you cook. Hands on experience. None of this tossing stuff, no. You gotta massage the canola oil into the asparagus. Okay, and the last thing I have to do is hard boil some eggs, which I have also never done before. So I hope I don't crack them all or overcook them. Can you overcook hard boiled eggs? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't like boiling water. It scares me. But I have my egg ready to go. And it's a little egg carrying case. My first ever hard boiled egg. I have my food. Finally. It took like an hour. I don't know how I'm supposed to eat it, but I'm just gonna grab a little bit of everything. One big bite of everything coming up. Wow. I enjoyed that bite a lot more than I thought I was going to. I'm giving this an A minus for taste. I'm gonna give this a C minus for preparation, mostly because I'm just really upset about the red onions making me have to go cry in a corner for a little bit. Um, but also there was just a lot of chopping and dicing and slicing and things. As a first time cook, this was not easy. Okay, so it took me an hour and a half, but I have my cauliflower rice chopped with salsa verde chicken and green beans with almonds. So, let's dig in. Hmm. I definitely prefer lunch, but this is still pretty good. I think I'd give this dinner a B for taste and for ease of preparation, We'll go with a B plus. Nothing was very difficult, but it did take me an hour and a half. You know, I want my dinner in like half an hour. I don't want to spend an hour and a half trying to cook things, but it's good. So I got my broiled grapefruit with coconut and my little bit of chocolate. Tastes like warm grapefruit. 
I was hoping for a little bit more, but it's good. It's good. I'm enjoying it. I think I'm gonna rate this a B for taste because it's good, but it's not like, oh my god, this is the best dessert ever. Um, and ease of preparation, I'm gonna go with an A because all I really did was cut it and stick it in the broiler for a little bit. So it's midnight and I finally finished cooking and preparing everything that I need for tomorrow. Um, I made my chia seed pudding for breakfast. I got my snack and my lunch together um, for tomorrow. So I am, I'm like dead right now. I've been on my feet all day. I cannot wait to go to bed. I'm so tired. I thought the hardest thing about this challenge would be what I was eating, that like having so many vegetables and whatever was gonna be like, wow, but um, the food itself has been really good. The hardest part today was all of the cooking that I had to do and the fact that it literally took me all day. I think I got up at like 11, made breakfast, had like a 20 minute break, made lunch, had like a 20 minute break, went to the gym, made dinner. I've been going, 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 going all day and I am just ready to sleep. I am looking forward to the rest of the challenge. I think the food's gonna be good. And the cooking is probably gonna get easier for me as I get used to like how to do everything. Um, so all in all, day one, uh, very successful food. Not quite as successful cooking skills yet, but I'm getting there and I'll see you on day two.